Welcome, everyone. Um, I've quit school two days after I have turned 18. This was one of the most scariest moments of my life. I didn't know where I was going and what I should be doing. I found it really scary because in school uh, they teach you that if you don't have a degree, that you would instantly fail at life and won't get certain things that you want. Uh, for me, I found out when I was younger that I would like to do, have, a, have a company for myself. I started a company in phone and tablet repairs when I was 13 years old. And I found out that I really liked earning money with it to do something for myself. And I liked the freedom of being an entrepreneur. In school, they teach you that you need to, be, uh, in, that you need to draw in between the lines. Uh, I was someone that couldn't draw in, in, the, in those lines. For me, I wasn't good in Dutch, I wasn't good in German, I wasn't good in math or physics or any of those subjects. I wasn't a fast learner, I, had really, I struggled a lot at school, but I still kept going with school until I was 18 years old and I finally made the decision for myself to quit with it and do something that I actually liked. Because when I was there, I found out that I didn't like it and I didn't like what I was learning for. Maybe for some of you, uh, you also see uh, that you may be studying for a subject that you actually don't like to do. For me, this actually, I did a, a study in product development and I didn't like doing this because it turned out that it actually wasn't product development but uh, product testing. And I really like to develop something. So eventually, uh, what I did when I was 18 years old, I've quit school, I started in a family company. And in a family company, I got a lot of space to just uh, develop myself and do things for all my own. And what I did there was, uh, I found out that I really like to develop something, and I really like to earn money for something and do something new. So what I eventually did was, uh, I developed a Tesla that could drive on hydrogen. So what I did was, I uh, picked out a fuel cell and I put hydrogen gas in it, it transformed it to electricity and I charged the battery while driving. This was a new, mo uh, a new power source for uh, driving an electric vehicle. And what it turned out is that for me, this was, was a new thing to do. I had to learn everything myself. It involved a lot of math, a lot of physics, what, which are two subjects I wasn't good at at school. And eventually it worked out and it worked. I got in the media, I got in the news, and a lot of uh, news um, channels picked it up. And what I saw was that people actually liked uh, that a young person of just 18 years old developed something new and actually, uh, well, got the balls to just do something like that. And I went out and do, did uh, those things. Uh, I developed myself more and more in the company and I'm now one of the persons that actually runs it. So I'm now 19 years old, it's only one year later. And what I just want to say is that if you need to find something that you like and that you also find something that actually um, uh, develops you more and more. It might be school, but might be even might be a job or with your friends. It doesn't really matter, but what the school system told to me was that I wasn't smart enough and I wasn't good enough to do all those things that I wanted to do because I had the dreams and I wanted to do big things and they always said to me, you can't get them, you can't do those things and uh, you can get it out of your head and maybe just study for a job and do that. But eventually it turned out that I actually could achieve those dreams and that I could do whatever, what I wanted if I just tried. So don't let a school system or anything say to you that you actually don't matter or that you can do something. Maybe just try something or in, even if you do something for half a year or one year, just try it at least. As long as you try it and that you can say in the end that you actually did it and that you maybe, maybe you, it didn't work out, maybe it works out. But as long as you don't have the regrets of not doing it. So don't let the system tell you you can't actually do something. But just enjoy your life and do something you like, do something you want, and just try. That's what I wanted to say. Grote applaus en diepe buiging voor Max. Yes.